Hi, welcome back to the Citizen tutorial. Last year, this tutorial was released. It included a tutorial showing how to export the Citizen cities as Unreal Engine 5 game level. This video is to show you what has changed in the latest versions of Citizen that affects that Citizen to Unreal Engine 5 workflow. Rather than just showing you the changes, I'll be going through the workflow as if I've just purchased the um, Citizen Ultimate version and edit the city and export uh, the final city to Unreal Engine 5. You see, um, I definitely recommend purchasing the Citizen Ultimate version because it's 10 times faster. That would be 10 times faster. Uh, than the Citizen Classic when exporting to Unreal Engine 5. Uh, if you w just want to check out the changes only, you can jump to the chapter specified in the description below. If you're new to Citizen, check out that video because it shows what keys are being pressed when editing Citizen, class Citizen Cities. So, let's jump into Blender. Let's suppose you have purchased the uh, Citizen Ultimate through the Blender market and these are f files that you need to download. Download Citizen Ultimate uh, version 4.0.4 and Citizen P Unreal dot zip. Two of these, two of those files. Once you download it, downloaded two of them you need to have you will find these two and let's go to blender and install the add-on click edit and preferences and install and locate the add-on and install click install add-on and click citizen ultimate and you will see these appear in the panel on the right and let's add a parametric city and editing is uh, editing the city is pretty simple it's basic uh, blender um, modeling as you model a simple plane as you edit a simple plane or geometry you can model the city and Citizen will interpret that basic geometry into grease and rows. You see, a uh, line without plane will be interpreted as a road or an overpass. In this case, overpass. Move this line slowly until you see the sweet spot where it interprets correctly interprets as a bridge with rows underneath. There you go. So we are ready to export this city. Before uh, exporting to Unreal Engine 5, you need to, we need to change the default assets with game friendly assets go down to citizen import and export panel which is available in the city ultimate version only and click load game friendly citizen assets oh before that it's safe to uh, uh, save the file Let's save this file as racing demo. Oh, citizen racing demo would be better. Okay, save the file. And now click load game friendly default buildings. And this would replace the default buildings of citizen with. Uh, game friendly version which makes export time 10 times faster and 
Here's a trick. Click Prepare for Mesh Export. When it's finished, uh, it will citizen will isolate the ground. And let's export the ground first. Export FBX file and remember these settings selected objects only. Mesh and unclick bake animation and unclick apply modifiers. That'll speed up the export time. And let's check out if there's anything else that we can speed up the export time. Okay, let's name this file ground and then click export. And now it's time to export the rest of them. Click select and invert. That will select all the rest of the geometry and let's export them. File, export, FBX, and using that settings, uh, let's export the rest of the props as props. And you can name this any, as anything as you want and click export xpx and this would take a little longer than before now once you're done let's go to the uh, the f f file and unzip citizen p unreal and go into the folder and click citizen p unreal and open up the Unreal Engine and clean up the windows. Let's import them. Click File, click Import it to Level, and locate the file. Okay, let's import the ground first and locate where we want to import our fbx file and remember remember these settings and click import okay i'm not sure it is, if it's a bug or something but but i'm not sure if it's a bug of the uh, default FBS export feature of Blender uh, that uh, we need to shuffle up the textures. But before we do that, let's uh, set up the collision settings for the ground first. Uh, Go click Static Mesh and go under, go down below to find Collision Presets and click Use control Complex Collision as Simple. And now let's fix those uh shaders let's shuffle them to find the right materials for each of them Okay, let's press play and check if the ground collision is working correctly. Uh, press W to go front, A to left, S to right, Z to backward. Okay, looks fine. Then let's 
get out of the game mode let's import uh import it to level the rest of the buildings let's find the buildings and click open and look at way we want to import the files level proto prototyping and click OK and it'll take a while once you're done oh uh, use the same settings that we use for the ground click import and get a cup of coffee or do something until the computer imports the files I recommend 30 minutes or something. Now, once the import process is, com is finished, we'll be able to see the buildings and props. Let's clear the windows. And we'll have all the buildings and city props ready with collision settings. Let's cl press, let's look at the city if, and check if the rest of the props have been imported correctly. And let's go to player start and you can change this gizmo the location of this gizmo mode and play click play and let's check if um, the collisions are working correctly let's move the vehicle with um, W to go to the front Z to go to back A to go to left and S to go to the right. And let's bump into that trash bins, trash cans. Yes, it's working. The collision's working correctly. Let's go backward with key Z. And let's speed up with key W, key W. And let's check if that pole has correct collision. Okay, that has collision working properly let's check if the bridge is set up correctly okay it works it's working correctly and we see those buildings okay this is so this is it so with citizen version 4.0.3 the export uh, citizen to Unreal export process has become far simpler. So this, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and likely the next tutorial would be revisiting uh, previous tutorial as to how to use your custom buildings and props when using Citizen for Unreal Engine 5 export. Thank you for joining us and let's see you next time.